Guys, a local cheerleader is getting online support after standing up to a couple of teammates who were allegedly bullying other classmates online. But how did her TikTok video end with a text exchange that got her cheerleading coach put on administrative leave? This girl, she disrespected so many people because of their race or sexuality. Jasmine Rimbert is more than just a typical teen cheerleader. She's an activist of sorts. We're not taking any steps forward. We're taking steps back, and it's because of people like you. This 17-second TikTok video posted by the 16-year-old was in response to social media videos posted by two of her teammates, allegedly using homophobic slurs, mocking a disabled cheerleader, telling a black student to go pick cotton, and joking about police brutality. I have, I have life. Please. <laughs> and with that, Jasmine made that clapback TikTok video. She also reached out to her cheerleading coach for help. But coach Jessica Hopton texted Jasmine criticizing her TikTok video, telling her, quote, what you did was also bullying Jasmine, and I hope you know that. Superintendent Joe Specia disagreed with coach Hopton's text exchange with Jasmine. But I think that she needed to spend a little more time in looking at everything that was going on uh, that led to, to the uh, text message she sent to um, uh, Jasmine. Since the incident, Jasmine has received online messages of support and says she doesn't want to be looked at as a bully herself. But Jasmine doesn't regret making her TikTok video or what she said in it. Honestly, I do not forgive them. They're both old enough to know that what they did is not OK. And I hope that they realize that now, Jasmine, who had been suspended from the cheer team, she was allowed back on the squad. Coach Hopton remains on administrative leave pending the investigation. No word on what, if any, disciplinary action will happen to Jasmine's teammates.